Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is a kind of a collective haul. Mostly it's just from American Crafts. Um, and I have a couple things that came from, I'm not even sure where they came from. I found a bag that I forgot about and it's either from AliExpress or Timu. I'm not sure which one. <laughs> so I'll share that one at the end. So let me just show you what I picked up there. Mostly it's just papers. So I just had found a few of these. This is a heritage sheet called Sincerely. So I just found a couple of those. And then I found a couple of these All Heart. So of course I had to grab whatever they have All Heart. That's the reverse side. And then the rest is a bunch of just um, card socks. So I got a bunch of these that have that glitter kind of into them. I really love this. This is a real kind of darker like slate blue kind of color. I got a few orange. It's not it's not a real bright, it's kind of a on the light side of orange. It's pretty lime green. It's more yellowy color. Really pretty. I got a couple of oh there's only one of this one. Must have only been one. Or maybe I thought I'd only use one. That kind of blue. Got about three of this one, this kind of aqua color with the sparkles. Okay, then these are just plain, you know, basil cardstock. Well, textured. I like textured cardstock. So, unless I'm stamping, then, um, then I'll use a different kind that I use for stamping. So, anyway, I got some of those purple and the light lilac pastel this blue and quite a few of this kind of minty color so quite a few of that one and then I grabbed quite a few of this little bit darker minty one I got some light pink I never have enough light pink and then I grabbed more of this one which is this um, it's shiny black paper. I've been using it a lot on these projects I've been making. Let me see if where's my piece that I have out that I'm already using. I can show you what I've cut into so you can see how it's kind of shiny. So it's really nice. It looks really great on these kind of projects. So I got a couple more of those because I, I think I only bought one or two the first time and um, I've used the heck out of it. So. I grabbed a couple more. Okay, and then I picked up this. It is so funny. I have I had some of these way back when, probably when they first came out, and I never used them. <laughs> and then I got rid of them all. Um, and now I'm thinking this would be so handy when I want to stitch on something that doesn't have holes already, because you just take, this just has like a head. Let me open this up and show you. If you haven't seen one of these it's just got this head that has like these little pokey things and as you run it it makes the holes in the paper okay now they have um interchangeable heads too so you can buy other heads that have different patterns and stuff and they also have some of these that you can interchange too that have that's a stamp roller um, i didn't get any stamp ones i just wanted just the plain basic stitch but they have some that's you know like crisscross and just different things zigzags stuff like that I just got the plain stitch. I just thought that would help me in. Sometimes I want to stitch and there's no holes, so it's easier to, you know, stitch something with some of the holes first. So I grabbed that. They're not very expensive. At least they weren't. I don't, this one was not too bad. Let's see, oh, back here, see here, you can see there's all different kinds of stitching heads available. So you can get, and you can, you only need one handle and then you just interchange the heads. Okay, and then you can, stitch very cute so I grabbed that <laughs> so it's funny if I would have just kept my stuff I would have still had that okay and then I grabbed um, a couple of these I had some of these up for sale also the glossy enamel dots this is from simple vintage linen market um, and I just love the colors of these These are kind of the shinier clear ones I like those I love simple stories um, enamel dots so grabbed a couple of those and then I found this, I'm not even sure who, Celeste Gonzalo, something like that. Anyway, I just like the colors and 
I don't really care for these. I don't hardly use pearls, but I love the enamel dots. So I grabbed that. And then lastly from American Crafts, I grabbed this thing, which is gonna be kind of hard to show. Um, I'll zoom out there a little bit. Um, it is, I can't remember what this is called, a lap tray or something like that. So it has this wood um, top here and it's the metal bottom. And I just thought this might be handy for like if I want to, I mean, I never do this, but maybe if I want, maybe if I had this, I would, but maybe like to take and like when I want to be in the room with my family and stuff to like watch TV or something, um, to use this on my lap to like do like dangles, you know, like bead wrapping and dangles and stuff like this. So I, I went ahead and snagged it and so I'll see if I, I use it, but it comes with all different kinds of things. So we got the lap desk. It comes with, okay, we got a pair of soft grip scissors. <laughs> They're like all, yeah, spongy. That's kind of different. Okay, so it came with that. Uh, what else does it have? Craft grip tools. So I guess you can add these on to other things. Um, say like a stamp. Um, no, these are for um, like to put on a different tool. Like so it makes it easier for the holding, hang on to and stuff. Maybe like a, I don't know what, but you can, <laughs> you get the picture. <laughs> so it came with that. It came with this thing, which is called a stamp handle. So it suctions to the um, flat surface of ink pads. Okay, so it came with that. Uh, these are magnifying glasses. So, I probably won't use much of any of this stuff, but it came with these magnifying glasses, and if I remember right, I think she said they might light up also. Can't remember if that's what she said. When you put the batteries in, Yeah, it has magnifier is 1.6 times with LED lights. <laughs> okay, well, you never know. That might come in handy, the whole there I get it. Okay, so there's those that came with it. It has, what is this? This looks like a knife. <clears throat> a straight thing it's, that fits over your finger. So you go like this, and it makes it easy to cut. I have one that's from, it's orange, it's from um, Fiskars. So anyway, that's this color. So there's that. There is an easy grip ruler. Grips to flat surfaces for easy use. Large numbers. Oh, I need that. So that's kind of cool. Okay, so it came with that. Um, oh goodness, it has lighted tweezers. Goodness, well, that's cool. That could come in very handy. So it has lighted tweezers. Um, I already told you about the Comfort Craft Knife, okay. And then it has these two things here, which are little, you know, little um, cup things that you could hang on the sides to put stuff in. So there's two of those. It's just foam. Okay, and then it also has easy read cutting mat. Okay, and that, <laughs> I may use more of these parts than I thought I was gonna use. Look at those big numbers. <laughs> so it, this just lays in here, or you can put it on top when you're, when you're um, crafting. So, and I thought maybe this fit down inside like the carts and I, my cart is from We Are Memory Keepers. I bought a pink one um, and I tried, it doesn't fit down inside, but it does sit like right on top of the top um, tray. So it could just like sit up there for storage out of the way if you wanted. And then the top, this wood piece, it like if you wanted to just cover up the top of your um, cart, it does fit down in there around the handle so it can just make your your top of your cart flat if you have something flat in there so 
it could be used a couple different ways. So that's pretty handy. So that's all the stuff that came in that. And I'm kind of more excited about it now that I've opened up more of the stuff and saw what all is in there and how that will work. So, okay. So we'll see how that goes. And then lastly, uh, I got, these are the things I told you. Oops, sorry for that. The lid flopped down. So I found a bag there today. I started putting stuff away and I found a bag of stuff. I'm like, what is this? And I went, oh my gosh. I must have just got it and forgot to put it away. Probably forgot to um, film it. But So I don't know if these are from Timu or from AliExpress, but they're one of the two. So a bunch of little sequins, these tiny little stars. Some are the star cut out and some are the, you know, like the hollow star. So really cute. So I got it in white. I got them in this one that's called Rose Red. So beautiful. I got them in this one that was called pink, of course. Beautiful, love it. And then I got this one called blue. Very pretty and shiny. And then I got this one called green, which is definitely a very pretty, you know, minty color. Gorgeous, I love all those colors. And then I also these <laughs> had these in here which are some hasty beads, but they're real pale and kind of <clears throat> like more see-through looking. Like look at this pink one. So look how pretty that is. Really pretty. So I had the blue, the pink and the blue. This one's called Sky. This one was called, doesn't say. Oh yeah, light. It just says pink light, maybe. Anyway, that's the little haul that I found that I didn't even remember I had. Okay, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down below, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.